so I just am gonna like film this really quick vlog, I guess. I was in the middle of recording um, a foundation review and my battery died on my camera, so it's charging and I'm hoping, excuse me, I'm hoping that by the time <laughs> my camera's done charging and gets enough charge, it's not gonna be night out because it's like three, four o'clock, I think, so we'll see what happens. Maybe I'll have enough sunlight to finish my review. We're just completely restocked, it's over. So there is a foundation review coming up. Um, I don't know. Um, Walgreens called because I had a job interview at Walgreens. They don't inter they don't hire you. Um, oh God, it's hair. I see it and it's there, and I'm just like, Arr. they don't hire you by um, you know how your interview goes. They actually hire you by how your um, you have to take this test, and they hire you by how you did on the test. So um, one guy, the guy scored like a point higher than me so they have to hire him before they hire me but he called to tell me that I was the best applicant of the day I don't know if he was just like kissing my ass or what but he like called to tell me I was the best applicant of the day and I basically like aced my interview I'm always terrified about doing job interviews I've only ever done two so that should say something but every time I do them um I always wind up doing like a spectacular job even if I have to talk out my ass I didn't talk out my ass though, but you, you know what I'm saying, so hopefully um, something good happens, but um, you know, until then, that's like where I'm standing. My hair, I have to get my hair cut because when the guy, um, I, I, I'm not sure if I said this, I know I've said it on Twitter, but when the guy cut my hair, he really messed it up. Um, I straightened it today, so if you can, like, without it being straightened, this whole side of my head is lighter see hold on look this whole one side of my head is more poofy than the other side of my head because it's you can even tell right here you know this whole one side is more you know has more poof to it I'm not saying volume because it's not volume it's just poof and it's really annoying and it's actually like my hair is so bad if I go anywhere like for my job interview I knew um, I was gonna be driving there with the windows down so I basically had to hairspray the bloody crap out of my hair just to get it to stay um, and not move, so that's really annoying, because my hair will look, like, like, terrible if I don't, like, slick my hair down, so it's, like, super, super annoying, and, ugh, so I have to, uh, I'm, I'm, like, not getting it, um, you know, layered anymore, because every time they layer it, they never do it right, maybe I'm just going to the wrong salon, I'm gonna probably just switch salons and see how it goes, but I'm not getting my hair layered until it completely grows out, so... <sighs> I do have to get it trimmed though, because it's getting re freaking ridiculous. <laughs> it really is getting really, really ridiculous. I know, I keep touching my hair, I'm really sorry. I'm just in, like, touching my hair mood. It's the guy from downstairs. Yeah, yeah I hope he's moving. But, um, you know... That's really all that's going on. Um, Chris is leaving, so it's gonna be another girls' night. It's just gonna be me and the cat. Like, she's gonna want anything to do with me in the first place. Um, so it's just gonna be me and the cat. I need more girlfriends to come over. Be like, come in, let's have a girls' night. Maybe I'll watch Grease. No, maybe I'll watch Titanic, I don't know. I probably will just like edit videos and things of that nature. Sorry if you hear the um, video game in the background. Um, Chris is playing Call of Duty and the cat wants to come out and she didn't come out when I came out and I shut the door. So she's puffing and puffing because I shut the door but the door is open. I have a weird cat. I have to go shut the light off. I will be right back. Today's already going to be one of the days I can tell you that right now. I don't know. Every, why does it look so dark? Maybe because my screen's dirty. I don't know. I'm telling you. Today's already going to be one of the days. I just... <laughs> was it getting a drink and dropped the whole container on the floor gosh yeah so that's really that's all going that's really what is all going on in my day oh god i killed you guys fail um so that's really all that's going on kitty Game into there she is Hi, new, new, hey, baby, new, moon, 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 Um, so yeah, uh, after that little weird episode I just had, I don't know. Um, it's actually really nice outside, so I figured I'd film some videos and then my battery died. Go figure. 
Um, um, what else is going on? Not much. Um, so maybe that's what I'm going to do when Chris leaves. Because um, Monday through Thursday he has his class to do, but it ends Saturday, thankfully. Um, Monday through Thursday he has his class he has to do, and so I'm going to basically be home from 6, no, 5.30 to like 10 o'clock I'm home alone. So I figured I would film some videos in the daylight and then edit them. That was really terrible sounding. My teeth are funky. Um, update on my thumbular. I call it a thumbular. See, it doesn't look so bad. Um, that whole top piece, it's not like open. It's just like the dead skin is just waiting to come off. So that's all that is. Um, and then that, it's healed pretty nicely. <laughs> I actually have this like, it's going to be a funky scar. It's really raised up. So if it stays like that, um, you know, it already, I, I might get over my fear and um, get a tattoo. I doubt it because I'm terrified of needles and the sound of just getting a tattoo just scares me. Um, but I know I was going to get a tattoo for my dad and for my mom, so we'll see. We'll see what happens. I don't, I don't know how that's going to go. I'm so scared. I'm not planning on getting it anytime soon, so don't think I'm getting it anytime soon. I do know I charge my iPad soon. Uh, I'm so bad on charging things. Um, as for the blogs go, I'm getting back on track with my blogging. Since my finger was like funky, this is really, my finger is still funky. Since it was funky, I couldn't really type too, too much. Um, cause you know, if I turn it the wrong way, it really hurts. And the muscle in, is really, really tight today, so. Yeah, I already posted today's blog. Oh, excuse me. I already posted today's blog post, so that's done. But I still have to type another one. And um, I don't know why I'm not doing the vi the video I'm doing. I might just I might just type up as a blog post as well because I know there's people who read my blog that don't see my channel. So we'll see how that goes. That's what I might do. I just have to take pictures of the product. Um, it's that secret foundation I've been talking about for the past month. I've not really been too too talking about it, but I have mentioned it. So that, sorry, my voice is like going. My allergies are killing me. Um, what else? Oh, wedding stuff, gosh. Um, we're still trying to decide weddings because where we were going to do it, Chris's mom, like, um, had said something and I'm like, great, they're going to associate it with that one. So I'm just like, <sighs> now I'm just like, great, now I got to find somewhere else to do it. It wasn't like a bad comment. It was just basically like an association with someone else's and that's not what I want. So we're going to have to look around again. Ooh, look, it's like dark. Light, 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 light. Um, that's it. Um, I was thinking of starting a wedding series on this channel. I don't... Somebody wishes it was cool. I was thinking of starting um, a wedding series on this channel. Let me know what you think. And yes, I was going to get Chris involved in it. And yes, when um, I do plan on getting my eyebrows done, um, I've been doing them myself and they're done terribly. They're not even shaped correctly because this one's shaped like this. Like, it goes up to a point and down and this one's more rounded because I just, I ended up messing them up and it was terrible. So I'm going to get my eyebrows done, I'm not sure. I might keep them um, thick like they are, but I don't know, I haven't decided. Um, I'm terrified of waxings and I was going to get them waxed. Uh, it's not even like uh, not enthused face. I was thinking of going to a benefit brow bar and doing it, but there's not one near me, so it would be like a hefty drive. So, and I'm having an issue with Ulta. Ugh. <sighs> they are just like the website does not like me at all, so it's kind of. 
stinks because um, it's an hour drive to an Ulta. Any close Ulta, the only Ulta that's near me, it's an hour drive. So I basically have to go drive an hour just to get the stuff and pray they have the stuff that I want because what's going on online is I have a gift card and it's not letting me use the gift card. It wants me to basically use four dollars from the gift card and use the rest of it from my um, bank card so it's like what is the point of giving a gift or having a gift card if you want me to use my own money um, so that's kind of so Thursday we're driving up to Ulta and praying they have what I want and if they don't I'm going to be very very discouraged um, I've bought a few things from Sephora, but I don't know. Every time I go to the Ulta near me, the ladies there are actually kind of really rude. <laughs> they actually, when I walked in the one time, excuse me, they actually looked at me like I shouldn't even be walking, how dare I walk into their store. So, um, all just customer service, they're really nice. Um, the last lady gave me a little bit of a hard time, but they're really, really nice, the customer service. Um... I've not called online, I've emailed their customer service, and, you know, they're really, really nice, but, um, I've just, when I've gone into the store, the ladies there are kind of a little rude, and, um, it's like, why are you gonna be rude to me? I'm giving you money, so, you know, I think the last thing I bought from Ulta, oh, was the foundation I'm gonna review, that's the last thing I bought from Ulta, and it was a ridiculously expensive foundation. But I'm, I'm just trying to, like, just buy a couple things and it's not letting me do it. So, we'll see how that goes. Um, Grace, the person does drop Um, we'll just see how that goes. Um, if I, I know I'm going to be doing a video on my main channel about it, so we'll see. There might be a video there from what I get from Ulta. So, I might as well just, like, drive down there anyways. Ugh, get away for the day few hours, whatever. Um, so yeah, I don't know. Before I continue rambling and it gets too, too long, because it's already, like, gonna be over ten minutes, I will see you guys later.